Hello once again and welcome back to LFC Online. It's your boy Harold and to some and some beautiful people I, I, might, I might add Lord Harold. So feel free to call me Ivor in which you, <laughs> Christian's looking at me like who the hell calls you that mate? <laughs> <laughs> so feel free to call me Ivor. Welcome to welcome back to the channel. I'm joined here once again by my very very special friend. His name is Dan Christian. Hello mate. Hello, sir. Uh, once again, back in back in the the Lord's manner. Uh, oh. Here for another here for another LFC.com video. Looking forward to it. Let's let's, right. let's go. Awesome, awesome. All right. So if you didn't already know, don't already know what this video is. It is part of the illustrious series. Honestly, nominated for countless. It's, it's even it's even nominated for Grammys. Don't ask me how. Somehow, it's been, this this quiz show has been nominated for a Grammy. All right. So this quiz show is called Who Am I? Okay, so it's really, really straightforward. It's one I enjoy so much. I really enjoy prepping for it. So I hope you guys enjoy it just as much. So to explain what this is all about, essentially, uh, there is a maximum of five clues per player. There'll be six players for Chris to guess. The more clues I give him in order for him to guess the player, the less points he gets. The quicker he can guess the player with fewest clues, he gets more points. More points means wins. More wins means prizes. Let's go. Happy <laughs> days. Oh, man. Goodness me. I feel like I feel like a talk show host. Honestly, this is fantastic. All right. So player number one. Chris, are you ready? I'm ready, sir. Let's do this. All right. All right. Let's go. Clue number one. He was born on the 17th of June, 1990. 17th of June 1990. And I'm, I'm actually gonna I'm actually gonna time these because it's gonna give people too much clues. <laughs> so I'm gonna bring up my timer on my phone to make things a little bit more difficult. So go on, you 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 go ahead as you were. I wouldn't know from that one. Obviously, I know he'd be turning 31 soon, and he'd probably be within the current Liverpool side. Hmm. I'm going to rush. you got five more seconds, mate. You can guess or you can move on. Roberto Firmino? All right. Second clue. That is incorrect. <laughs> he was signed for Liverpool in 2011. Oh, Jordan Henderson. Jordan Henderson is correct. <laughs> well done, mate. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. So that is a possible four out of five points. That's how it works. You guess on the second clue, you get four of the possible five that are available. Of course, it is out of a, uh, a possible 30, and the score to beat is Fahi's 20, All right? Ooh, he did really well. He did really well, unfortunately. So, <laughs> player number two. After starting his career at Anfield... He is now a manager. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. It can't be that easy. No. Who could it be? Jabby, Jabby, oh, starting his career. Oh, so he was a Liverpool player. For, ah, okay. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't think of anyone who's, who's a manager at the moment from who was a Liverpool player. Robbie Fowler? Oh my goodness. <laughs> How on earth did you get that? He's the only guy I could think of who's wow. like being Liverpool. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. Incredible. The answer Top is Top one and only Robbie <laughs> Fowler. He has scored a blinder. Actually, I, I forgot to say the rest of the, uh, the clues from the other one. So I'll start with Jordan Henderson. The rest of the clues I had there for you. So the third clue was that he has 59 caps for England. The fourth clue was that his middle name was Brian. I'm sure he would have got it after that. Um, and of course, the fifth clue is that he's a current Liverpool captain. So you've got Robbie Fowler after one clue. So the second clue <laughs> was that he once scored 16 goals at youth level in a single match. Believe it or not. Um, the third clue, now this definitely would have given it away. He received a £32,000 fine after a certain celebration against Merseyside rivals Everton. Um, and number four, he's, a, he's the holder of the second quickest Premier League hat-trick in the Premier League, like I said. And fifth, fifth, and fifth clue was he has the nickname God. Okay, well, goodness me, you've smashed out the bloody park, mate. All right, onwards and upwards, right? L none to the next person that... I 
almost said. Okay. <laughs> did, you, did, you, did you hear that? Did you hear what I said? I didn't. I didn't. Thank I, God. I always I didn't do hear. this. It's because it's in bold. <laughs> like, it's so, anyway, anyway. <clears throat> the lights, the lights are getting to me. First clue. This player was born in Barcelona. Luis Garcia? <laughs> How on earth did you, What is going on? What is going on? Chris. Uh, it's you know you know when you like you really surprise yourself with the stupid amount of information that you know. <laughs> oh my word. I can't even get through the I'm not, I should have just stuck with one clue. Wasted all my bloody time trying to find the rest of these clues. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and say, bloody hell, well done. Um, second clue, he has the most caps for us throughout his entire... He, has, he, had, he played the most games for Liverpool throughout his career. He scored the, most, he scored the header winner header winner against Everton in the Merseyside derby in March 2005. He was signed from Atletico Madrid for £6 million in the summer of 2004. Of course, the same summer where we signed the one and only Xabi Alonso. And fifth clue, he's the scorer of the so-called ghost goal. The ghost goal. Of course. All right. Third, oh goodness, I can't say third player, fourth player. You're zooming through these. Okay. <laughs> if you get this at the first clue, I don't know what I'll do. I have to give you some sort of prize, honestly. Like, and I'll, I'm, I'm serious. All right. And I'm, 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 I'm seeing you on Friday. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm giving you some. Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay. First clue. His youth career started at a club called Cadbury Athletic. Uh, Daniel Sturridge. <laughs> <laughs> My God. Bonville, you know what I mean? <laughs> no, I need to make these harder. Oh my word. Oh, that, my that, one, that one is solely because West Midlands. That is the only reason. Oh, I is it? That. Yeah, yeah. You know what's funny? Because I was going to say, um, he, grew, he grew up in Birmingham, but I was like, there's no way I'm saying that. Chris lives right near Wolves. Like, <laughs> like there's no way I'm saying that. That's the, Those are your ends. I can't do that. And then you... I, Honestly, I only thought you were going to say you knew this because of the, um, there was an England video that he had with Raheem Sterling. And they were saying, and that Sterling was like, they asked him a question, how, much, how well do you know Daniel Sturridge? And then they said, that what club did he start his career at? And he didn't think Cadbury Athletic were a real club. So, oh my gosh, I don't know how you bloody got that. Anyway, <laughs> making a mockery out of this. The second clue was that he scored in his debut against Mansfield Town in the FA Cup to seven minutes in. The third clue is that he once, this is a funny game, he once blasted over a penalty in a Merseyside derby whilst on a hat trick <laughs> and then was subsequently substituted. Um, he has two Champions League medals and he was, he was one part of the SAS attack three. Okay. Okay, next person. Let's go. First clue. Let's go. Liverpool Football Club is only the third club he has ever played for. Third club he's ever played for. Bloody hell, you get this right off the bat. I don't know what I'll do, honestly. I'm just yeah, I'm, like I'm not going to get this one. <laughs> that will actually be ridiculous. Uh, third club he's ever played for. It's, it, does this guy still play for Liverpool? Or? Uh. Third club. That could be anyone. All right. I'm going to rush you. You've got five seconds. You get it, yeah. I'm going to default. I'm going to say Firmino. Is it? Is it really? <laughs> I can't believe this. Honestly, like, I can't believe this. I know he played for a team in Brazil, then he moved to Hoffenheim, and then obviously he played for Liverpool. Oh, my word. What is... <laughs> <laughs> I think you've already beaten the score. You've got 5, 10, 15, 20. You've already got 24 out of 25. Let's go. Let's go. That is ridiculous. <laughs> that is genuinely ridiculous. He's a witch. He's a witch. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, you got to have the whole comment section screaming that. Like, <laughs> they're probably going to think that you, you and I are in cahoots, for goodness sake. I can't There's believe no this. Like, There's no like, cahoots. This is no, off, genuinely, off, off, the, guys, off the dome. Guys, ge viewers, genuinely... He has got these. I don't know how. I'm getting hot and flustered because I'm thinking, is there, <laughs> like, am I being punks? Like, what is going on? Is there a camera on me? 
my goodness. Next clue was that he spoke, he speaks Portuguese, English, and German. Would you have got that? Possibly. Ooh. Possibly. Possibly, possibly. The, ne the next one, I think you might have got it. He was one of the few signings not to be signed by Klopp, but to remain in his squad. That Ooh, probably, yeah, yeah, you probably, probably would have yeah, yeah. got that. Um, he scored a, yeah, all these great clues I couldn't even bloody say, yeah? All right, look at you nodding along. <laughs> he, he scored the deciding goal in the, of course, you would have got that from there. So the Club World Championships, a final against Flamengo. And fifth clue, he has the whitest teeth in the league. All right, okay. <laughs> the next person, and this is the last person, you could get zero out of five and you're already top. This is genuinely <laughs> ridiculous. I cannot believe what I'm seeing today. But I, I have to make sure I'm still recording to, to record his masterpiece. <laughs> All right. First clue. Oh, I don't even know if I should do this. I think this, I, I feel like he's not even good enough anymore. You know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop this around and make it so vague. He made 38 Premier League appearances in the 18-19 season. Repeat that again, sorry. First clue. He made 38 Premier League appearances in the 18-19 season. I'm going to be strict with my time because you're doing far too bloody well. Uh, 38 appearances, that means he played every single game. Alisson? <laughs> <laughs> Chris, Chris, what are you actually doing? Like, what is actually going on? I don't know. I don't, I just, it's, it's... No one's ever beaten this. <laughs> no one is ever beating this record. No one has ever beaten this. You've just gotten five out of five, five <laughs> times in a row. Like, that actually could have been a variety of players in that, in that campaign. You are I so annoying. 38 I'm, appearances. I'm just thinking, who is kind of close to playing all the games. So I was gonna, either going to go Virgil or I was going to go Alisson. That's what I thought. You were going to go Virgil. And I didn't think you'd go Alisson because of his injury problems. I'd hope that you'd forget. But he did play <laughs> and he was ever present in that fantastic 97-point haul that we had that, that campaign. Sorry, was it 97? Yeah, 97-point haul. I'm actually going to say he made his Liverpool debut in a 4-0 win against West Ham. Would you have got that? Probably wouldn't have, you know. Damn it, I should have said that first. Well, <laughs> mate, well done. Um, his only assist came against United. He was once baptised. He, he once baptised our very own Bobby Firmino. We would have got that there. And he was the most expensive keeper in football for about four weeks until Chelsea signed Kepa Ariza Balaga. <laughs> that is still the most bizarre thing ever. He was the, the most important, expensive keeper in all of football. And that record was usurped by Kepa Ariza Balaga. Yeah, of all genuinely people. ridiculous <laughs> of all players as well. But Chris, honestly, I tip my hat to you. That is, that's, that's sensational, mate. You got 29 out of a possible 30. That is unheard of. It means I need to make my questions far more vague, far more difficult. <laughs> I said he was born in Barcelona and you said Luis Garcia. How on earth? Like, how on earth? I remember, I remember him playing for Barcelona B. That's, that's it. That could have been anyone of, of, the, uh, of the Rafa contingent, in all honesty. Literally. Like, literally. <laughs> Well, honestly, I, like I said, I tip my hat off to you. <laughs> that is the, the greatest performance I think we will ever see in, in a Who Am I quiz. So whoever comes next, whoever you are, honestly, you have big, big boots to fill. Best of luck. Chris, any, any closing words for your, for your champion speech? <laughs> Well, I think I think I've set the benchmark quite high. Um, I like to see the next. I like I like to see someone try and get thirty. That would be a I'd be quite that'd be quite the achievement. Um, uh, but but no, I've I've had a, I've had a ball of a time. Thank you very much for having me on, Harold. Um, and yeah, I'm I'm looking forward to see who's going to be next to run the gauntlet. <laughs> so humble, even in even in incredible victories. So. <laughs> What a guy! You can you, you can you can text me to let me know. In fact, you know what? What would you like? Actually, no. You know, I was, I was going to ask you what would you like, but who knows what you're going to say? Let's, <laughs> let's let's leave that for offline. We can we can chat about that in our in our in our very many group chats or personal chats that we have. Let me know what you like as your as your treat, wherever you want to have. Um, <laughs> mate, guys, this has been Who Am I with Chris. 
Fish is just, just blown out of the park. Ain't nobody ever beaten Tay 9 out of 30. Fantastic <laughs> work, mate. Take care, guys. Like if you enjoyed it, of course. Subscribe if you're new. Click that notification bell as well so you don't miss any of our uploads. Take care. God bless and peace. Thank you.